welcome to mom's kitchen so we're going to be making drop biscuits and this is a very old-fashioned recipe from the original betty crocker's cookbook and i use this cookbook a lot okay so we're going to start by putting two cups of flour in I use unbleached King Arthur flour. I'm going to be able to start doing more of these baking videos because flour has been kind of hard to find right now, but I was able to order some through a restaurant distributor and have it shipped to the house. Okay, and then I'm going to add two and a half teaspoons of baking powder. And then one teaspoon of salt. And I'm just going to stir this in. Get those all mixed together good. Okay, and now I'm going to put one quarter of a cup of shortening. You can make these and um, put a little bit less milk in them and roll them out if you want, but it's so much easier just to drop them if you have a busy day. Okay, put that right in there. Okay, I'm gonna stop and preheat my oven to 450 degrees. Okay, so what I do now is I take a fork and I'm going to mash this all in here and work that right in. It's called cutting and shortening. And I'm going to keep doing this until that shortening is worked all the way up into that flour. And there's no big chunks like see right there that's a big chunk we want it all worked in so that there's no chunks and it'll take a few minutes and once again it's a little bit awkward as I try to reach around the camera here If you just keep mashing it in, you'll get it. If you use the bleached flour, then these are kind of dry. And it's not as healthy for you to use the bleached flour because they end up bleaching out a lot of the nutrients. Okay, you see how that's all mixed right in? Everything's fine. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and add a cup of milk. Ok, 
Okay, and I'm just going to stir that right in with this fork. Until it's all moist. You don't want to over stir this, but you just want everything moist. Okay, now get my baking sheet. I am going to give it just a little bit of spray. You don't have to with biscuits, but this will help. Just a little bit right there on the bottom. And now I'm going to take just a tablespoon like this out of my silverware drawer. And I'm going to literally drop these right out onto the baking pan here. Okay, that gives me eight. Okay, and they're going to go right into this oven. Just a second, let me wash my hands. Okay, they're going to go into the oven for 10 to 12 minutes, and I'll be back to show you what they look like. So this is what the drop biscuits look like when they come out of the oven. And the bottoms are nice and brown, and I'm going to get one buttered, and I'll show it to you in just a minute. Okay, so here it is. I just cut it in half and put some butter on it. This is going to be delicious. All right, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.